Hello, you're with Two Stroke Tom and the real Jesse James. Today we're going to decode GMRPO codes. All right, here we go. 2005 Suburban Z71. You can see this tag right here in the glove box on all GM products that have one. You can tell little things about your truck, you know. Yeah, things I'm interested in would be like the gear ratio because I'm going to eventually put mud tires on this truck. I want to know what what gear ratio it is so I know how big the tires I can put on here without, you know, sacrificing pulling power. So GT4, I know GT4 has 373 gears. G80, that is a limited slit rear end, basically a, like a factory locking differential. This truck is a Z71. That's where the name comes from. ZPO, Z71 RPO code. And uh, let's look at another example. My most recent acquisition is a 99 Suburban 2500. Four wheel drive, big block. And here we go. Same thing. GT4. 373 gears and an example would be gt5 is 410 gt4 is 373 g80 uh locking differential is a limited slip that's like a factory limited slip so let's look at another example this is a buddy of mine's truck no it's not for sale it is a beautiful 1996 or 97 uh, Chevrolet half-ton truck. It is a 98. I'm sorry. And here we go. Same thing. This this truck's kind of destroyed on the inside, so easy for me to show you exactly what's going on because the glove box glove box was just laying in a floorboard, but uh. GU6, that's going to be a 3.42 gear ratio. I ain't looked up none of the other numbers. I just, just, just showing you examples of different things on the rear ends and stuff like that. I ain't trying to figure this truck out. Let's go to the next one. Another Chevrolet truck out in the pasture. Here we go. You can see this is uh, like a 2002, 2003 uh tahoe two wheel drive but that's gt4 okay gt4 s373 years g80 lock and diff see it's not a z71 there's a z ones there's no z71 it is two wheel drive i ain't looked at the rest of the stuff to see what all it's got on and i ain't worried about it this is going to be my all-wheel drive race truck and yes it is in the bushes it ain't got a whole lot wrong with it. It's got some parts, door panel, and stuff laying back there, but saveable truck. There's the old Tahoe. Now, some of y'all may ask, go, why would you need to know what them letters and numbers mean? It means if you go to the junkyard, let's say you tear the rear end up in your truck, and you're trying to find Nissan. The identical rear end to go in there, as long as it's factory. Go. You gonna look? See my uh, Z71 Suburban out there. It's got GT4, 373 gears, G80 lock and differential. That two wheel drive Tahoe has got the exact same rear end. It's two wheel drive, not a four wheel drive. They both ten bolts because they're in a half ton. Then Ollie, that's the next truck we're gonna look at. Is that one right there? This is going to be my mud truck. This is the all-wheel drive donor. Yes, it's also in the bushes. There's a lot of bushes around here. <clears throat> this is the all-wheel drive donor for my quote-unquote two-wheel drive Tahoe race truck. Right now. Right now, I see. It's, right now, it's two-wheel drive. It's going to be all-wheel drive. Let's see, this is where I'm lift. I'm lift not knowing a dang thing about this truck because... The glove box is gone. 
I have no idea what gears is in this truck. Of course, I can't figure it out. There's ways for me to figure it out. And this truck's basically destroyed on the inside. Obviously, they wanted the Denali interior. But, uh... It sure would be handy just to have that information, just so I could know common knowledge. But this truck will eventually be sitting on some big old tires. Not sure what tires yet, but I've looked around in here trying to see maybe they peeled the sticker off or whatever. There ain't, there ain't, ain't no sticker in here. So that's the reason why you want to know. Just in case you got to go to the junkyard figure out what's on each truck y'all do me a favor and go ahead and subscribe to the channel it's a new channel and then like and share and comment rpo appreciate it